What's going on guys? Chupoy Adjen, back again and welcome to my channel. So today, I am back here in Path to Nowhere. I came back to Path to Nowhere because some of you guys don't know, Path to Nowhere is going to be celebrating its second year anniversary. And we all know that anniversary celebrations in gacha games are always a good thing, are always hype. Maybe except for Genshin Impact's first year anniversary, but yeah, PTN is going to be celebrating its second year anniversary soonish. Uh, I don't know the exact date, but I think this week. I think this week it's the the time where they were going to be starting the anniversary campaign for the second year anniversary. And I cannot resist going back into Path of Nowhere because I do love this game. Uh, I played this game for quite a long time. Not really a long time, but I think for a year. I can't re really remember the exact uh, exact time when I quit the game. I quit the game because uh, I just uh, felt boring uh, with the gameplay. Because the gameplay is usually pretty much the same over and over again. Even though uh, I don't really uh, find the end game that much uh, before uh, to be exciting anymore. Uh, even though they release some uh, really challenging content. Uh, the Dark Zone or something like that in the uh, broken uh, battlefield uh, i think uh, i quit because uh, i i just lost interest but i think it's time to get to get back into the game and i think i miss out on a lot of things also uh, there is a new game mode that i've that i've seen when i try to browse uh, when i just came back and right now patton over is on a rerun with the rain burst uh, event here uh, I've already done this event before, so yeah. Uh, I do have this uh, character here, Rahu. But I haven't played with Rahu. Uh, I think that is the time after Rahu's banner was the time that uh, I quit uh, playing the game. I think during the time of uh, Shalom uh, banner, because I did, I was, uh, I was also not able to get Shalom. Yes, but if you will see here, I have here Baihi. Uh, very very wide one of my favorite characters in the game and look at her skin man her skin is just gorgeous this is not pre to, pre, uh, pre -to play skin by the way <laughs> this is paid skin yes i am not a uh, pre to play in this game i am a spender in this game i am, I am a dolphin in this game uh, so it's and my account is pretty stuck uh, if you don't know my account is pretty stuck if you take a look at my characters here i have a lot of level 90 characters Zoya, Nox, Bayi with uh, dupes, two dupes, Serpent, uh, two dupes, Langley, three dupes, Irene, Hamel, level 90, Summer with one dupe, uh, Deren, a limited character with one dupe, uh, Owo, uh, Raven, Rahu, yeah, level 90 already, Lubia Ray, Enfer, uh, other s character is our uh, Stargazer, Oak Casket, and then Drea. And then Adela. I think this one was the last character that I've got. Adela. Or maybe even... Uh, I, I really can't uh, remember who was the last senior S-rank character that I've gotten. But I think it's really time to get back into Path of uh, Because I miss my waifu. The character designs in Path of are uh, really unique. They have their own style. And that's what makes them uh, really, really attractive to certain uh, players or certain people out there. Why am I lagging? Like what? What happened? Oh, because I am uh, viewing Langlis Battle Pass King. Yeah, but Langlis Battle Pass King always gets into me. Very, very gorgeous. Very, very nice legs and if you played path of nowhere before and if you decided to return into the game there will be some returning events or returning missions for you like me so i returned today so i got this uh welcome back to campaign here uh we have here a drop rate up event all areas item drop rate up and then accessible all day meaning all the resources that has some schedule uh, are all going to be accessible for you uh, if you are a returner 
And then we have here some warm up missions here. Nasyo ko si AM on day 1 and there are really really nice things here. I don't know what is this one for. What is this one? Uh, I cannot unlock them because uh, it's it's uh, time gated since I am already in uh, day one. Uh, but here we can get 200. Uh, what is this? A uh, selector, uh, a rank selector, 120, and then 120, 240 plus uh, 200 is 440 plus 100, 540. So 540 gems, a uh, hypercube. Uh, to get if you're a returner and then uh, I don't know if we will be getting some tickets here I cannot see the rewards because this is my uh, day one of uh, coming back into Patonover but it's really good that they have this kind of uh, returning missions for returning players it's a, a, a bit of a uh, bonus for returning players aside from this one we are going to be getting a heartfelt gift I've already gotten this one you, you will get uh four summon tickets no five summon tickets in total uh this is a uh, login event so today i got one ticket here and then tomorrow i will be getting a 200 stamina uh then the next day two tickets then currency gold uh this one is for uh getting a random crime brand crime brand is something like your artifacts or the equipment in this game and then uh, currency to level up your character and then on the last day the seventh day uh, you will be getting a uh, another summon ticket too so to a total of five summon tickets just by uh, logging in during your uh, welcome back campaign uh, we also have here the return supply uh returning supply is for spending uh, returners yeah if you want to buy this one uh, maybe you can uh, get them uh, for a bit cheap i think this one is uh, in my currency 82 so 82 around 20 bucks if i will be converting this one to usd so this one costs 20 bucks for a multi's worth of salmon and then this currency the ultra cube uh, it's something like uh, how do I compare this one? The other uh, pre the premium currency that can be converted into this one, and also this one are uh, the ones you use to buy skins. Yeah. Also, if you join and uh, play out play a uh, pattern over right now, you will be able to get a pre costume for Kokelik. Kokelik. I think that, that is how it's pronounced. Uh, I do not have this character. This one has a uh, ongoing banner right now. And she looks gorgeous. She looks gorgeous, but I'm not really interested to summon right now. Uh, because I'm going to be using my summons on the upcoming uh, anniversary banner. Anniversary banner are always uh, really good. Because they bring a limited character. I think Shalom is also a limited character, if I remember correctly. Shalom. I'm going for Shalom because I, I was not able to get her during uh, she was rated up. And we will be getting lots of freebies once the anniversary starts. I think we will be getting also a pre-multi. Uh, just by lagging on day one at the start of the second anniversary. So it's really a good time to start playing Path to Nowhere. If you take a look at now the end game, I've seen that they added a new end game called this one, the Eternal Nightmare. Uh, judging by the looks of this one, uh, this one looks kind of like uh, uh, what is this tutorial? Uh, like the roguelike game mode yeah this is your uh, roguelike game mode uh, in this game uh, i have not tried this one yet i will be trying this one soonish i'm gonna be making some uh, video about this one on my uh, very first experience on playing this game mode but not today i'm a bit tired from work <laughs> so i'm not going to be uh, doing this one now. maybe when the adversary also kicks in you also have this kind of currency here the real cube where I believe uh, we can exchange for some uh, something good. I don't know. 
yeah this one really looks very fun to play uh, i don't know if the characters you use here are the, your own character or you, you, you really don't need to uh bring uh oh we can use other character no my characters no 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 we, we can use characters that uh, we haven't gotten i don't have this mantis here uh, i don't have lady pearl i don't have 11 i do not have vanilla i don't have hesia i don't have pistol so yeah i'm missing a lot of characters already by uh, quitting so I need to uh, try and uh, get back into summoning for them. <laughs> yeah, I'm missing a lot of characters. Take a look at my characters here. You can see your character collection here. So for the, let's start with the violence. I'm missing this one, this chick here. For the love, I'm missing one, two, three, four, four characters. So five now. For greed, it's perfect. Uh, for treachery, I'm missing one. So, six characters missing. For limbo, I'm missing a lot. One, two, three. Three. So, six plus three, nine. For anger, complete. Heresy, I'm missing one. So, ten. For slot, one, two, three. Four. Who's this one? Yeah, four. So, 14. For prod, I'm missing a lot. 1, 2, 3, 4, 18. Immortal, I do have Immortal. I do have Drea. So, yeah, I'm missing a lot of characters. And I, I hope that I can get them during my summons for the upcoming second year anniversary banner. Well, I think I've tackled uh, most of the things that I am quite excited about during my return to out to uh, Path of Nowhere. <laughs> so yeah, one thing I regret though in uh, in my quitting outer quitting Path of Nowhere before is that uh, I lost my uh, pounded guild. Yeah, I found a guild before, and my guild is pretty pretty strong, which is uh, called Tick. So whoever has my uh, guild right now, maybe uh, you might want to give it back to me. <laughs> Anyways, I'm on Asia server by the way. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And I think that's it for me for today guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it if you could help me grow my channel more. And thank you to everyone who are supporting my channel. I appreciate every one of you. Until next time, peace.